Hi, welcome. Thanks for clicking on my video. In this one, I'm going to show you how I make my delicious fruit and vegetable water. Have you ever been to the grocery store and they had some bottles of water with chunks of fruit in it that cost a couple dollars? Well, it only cost a couple dollars to buy some fruit and vegetables that you like, like limes, lemons, cucumbers, mangoes. Uh, honestly, you name it, you can throw it in some water. Leave it on, leave it in the water overnight for like 12 hours. I leave it overnight. I mean, you could do it in the daytime, but it's just better to leave it overnight. So I always cut it, you know, right before I go to bed, which I'm doing right now. And, um, yeah, here we go. So here I am with my cucumber my two lemons and my two limes. I've already washed them and cut up a little bit of my cucumber, so I'm going to show you how I cut up some of my cucumber. You should probably cut these in really thin slices, but I'm not the best at cutting, so try your hardest. When you get to the end of the fruit, you can turn it around and cut off the very butt. Makes it a little easier to cut it off so you don't cut your fingers and then throw the butt away. Put the fruit right in your pitcher. You have to have a big pitcher to put the fruit and the water in. And then you just got to finish cutting your fruit. It's so slippery and scary. Right there. Nice, I guess. Not? Not really, no. To be honest. Push the lime into the mouth. Away. wash my hands. Never a bad idea. They're getting a little slippery. Once you have all of your fruit and vegetables cut up in your pitcher, you're going to fill it up with water. And there you have it, fruit 
water. Love it. So make sure you pick up your favorite fruit at the grocery store the next time you come around, you go there. And cut it up, put it in a pitcher, fill it up with water, wait 12 hours for it to soak up, and then you take out all of the fruit, and then you have good, um, delicious water to drink. Thanks for watching. Bye.